and welcome to The Antique Show. The design magazines have always encouraged us to decorate our homes in a particular style or period. But the reality is, most of us have a mishmash of different furniture and objects, either inherited or bought new. Well, the good news is, the latest style is mixing old and new together. The challenge is to do it successfully. At the Battersea Decorative Arts Fair, designers put together a room set to demonstrate just how antiques and modern furniture do work together. So what generally are you looking for here? Well, with our room set, which is very, very modern furniture, quite simple in shape, I'm looking for perhaps more intricate details of antique furniture to mix with right. that. Anything here? Look here at the detail, the carving, the more intricate shapes of this carving at the back. Then I would contrast the, the simple form of the table. The simple furniture is not going to offend these antique pieces. So the that's idea the is something very simple with something quite ornate exactly. and that works together. And that's where the mix comes. This is a late 19th century English tavern table. Look how modern that looks. It does look modern, doesn't it? So you think this would go with the kind of modern Absolutely. furniture? Absolutely. I mean, this for. could have been a piece that could have been designed for that modern collection. This is very important in the feature of the room set in dividing the living space with the dining space. Being a folding table, you can push it to one side and make the spaces work together. Forgive me for saying so, but this does just look like a clapped out old table. So how's it going to work in your super modern setting? You're right, it does look like a clapped out old table, but you've got to remember what's going on it. The objects that are going on it, being a chrome, reflective, mirror-like surface, can reflect back into the object, the patterns and the textures and the shapes of this table. So it's quite cool in that sense. And he's right, it does look cool. But to do it successfully, you have to have the courage of your convictions. As Brits, we're usually a bit more traditional, but now it's time to break some rules. In the sort of 70s and 80s, people sort of just didn't dare mixing new stuff with the old. And then in the 90s, we got the absolutely minimalist, pared-down look, and people didn't dare put old into that. But now things are beginning to mix together again, and, and I notice that even people like Philippe Stark and all the hotels he does now has old bits of furniture in the public spaces, certainly. It's just a question of being selective, really, and, and, being, and being a bit brave, too, not saying, oh, that, bit of, that object's too big to go on that table. No, just try it. Scale always works. 